Hey, what's up everyone? I'm going to pick up where I left off last for my last Strange Sounds Twitter page video of various things happening in the world around us where I report on so many different things. First, the first Strange Radio Pulse has been... has been, uh... discovered. Some sort of a radio signal, they claim, from within our galaxy. I reported on that last time. Also... The fact that Earth's magnetic north, and this is what the magnetosphere supposedly looks like around us, the the Earth's magnetic north is heading has, is just on the move towards Siberia, Russia, and no one no one knows why. No one can explain why the poles are shifting like that. And over in Niger, Africa, the sky has turned blood red. Very eerie there, according to the reports. Talk about space rain. Apparently they've discovered that it's literally raining plasma on the sun. This is the plasma rain on the sun. Now they're talking about the hunger pandemic plaguing this world right now. People say I'm afraid of getting sick and I'm afraid of starving. They claim that this is the worst humanitarian crisis since World War II, reported here from the Strange Sounds Twitter page under hashtag pandemic and hashtag world and famine. Prayers and love, everyone. And for those that don't realize or don't know how big, how large these murder hornets are, here they are, these Japanese murder hornets. Here's an example. Astronomers just discovered the closest ever black hole ever discovered, and they say due to this, they discovered there could be more even closer. And there may even be many black holes all over the place, as previously as previously theorized by astronomers, if you've ever watched a uh, one of the Nova specials about that. Just a bunch of Amish individuals moving a pole shed in Wisconsin from one area to another. Nice to see people working together. For a common goal. One positive thing here. An anomalous event of methane gas vents discovered at the northern Cascadia zone. And out of control wildfires are raging right now in the Florida Panhandle, forcing dozens of evacuations. I'm sorry, thousands of evacuations and dozens of homes have been destroyed. And just as reported in one of my previous videos, the prediction has come true. Thousands more swarms of these large locusts expected to invade via Ethiopia through Kenya. Sorry, Kenya via Ethiopia. It's going that direction and once again destroying all of their crops in sight for the second time this year. And a deadly earthquake has struck. Under, under a sleeping volcano, a previously thought to be a sleep volcano, a deadly earthquake has taken place underneath it in Tehran, Iran. After this took place, panicked residents spilled into the streets. And once again, extreme weather, an extreme weather pattern in May, this Mother's Day weekend, as a strong high-pressure system is pushing down, low-pressure system is on the other side, the Greenland block is taking place, intense storms out into the ocean and the northeastern coast, snow, that's correct, snow is expected for Mother's Day weekend, the jet stream centered right over the state of Tennessee, lots of winds expected, the Omega block is to the west, and it's going to create an extremely rare May pattern, but an extreme pattern to say the least, as a strong high is above, and pushing down, it's just just look at all of this chaos. And then extreme warmth being pushed toward Florida and toward the west, fueling those wildfires as well. But bringing temperatures into the 20s and 30s and 10s, or 10 degrees, teens, all across the United States. To put it in perspective, there's a bomb cyclone in New England, record cold in the south, and snow in the northeast. That's just a few of 
the highlights. And the latest image of from Paraguay, a fisherman swimming through dead fish as far as the eyes can see. Very sad as more mass fish and bird die-offs just randomly hit various places in this world. A mysterious mass die-off of fish again, this time in Paraguay. A river of dead fish floating everywhere. All right, that's the last of the latest news. I'll bring you more as I see it. Stay as safe as possible. Signing out. Peace, everyone. My links are below if you'd like to show support. Feel free to, please feel free to help out through the link and to both PayPal and Cash App as well as my email. Signing out.